Guys, it's uh, McSon here, and this reaction here comes courtesy of uh, my Discord, suggest as a suggestion, and you know what? Um, yeah, I, sh I, I should uh, do this do this more often here. Suggestions from my Discord server, and everything like that. I mean, well, a lot of stuff they bring up here. I'm just going to re do a reaction either way, just to. Say my thoughts, my initial feelings about this, so on and so forth here. Uh, but this, I had no real desire to react to this. Even though, okay, you got Samuel Jackson back to Nick Fury. And it's a series, and it's more serious. Uh, yeah, sure, it's a Marvel Studios Secret Invasion. And like I said, this is, a, this is an original series. Right out loud. Sorry about that. And yeah, we got so the, the scrolls are a factor here, even though the scrolls were a thing, like miss in uh, Captain Marvel, and we had like the whole Spider-Man. Um, was it No Way Home or far, I, I forget which one? The second Spider-Man movie here, where the end result show. Yeah, the scrolls are on Earth here, but they're kind of working for Fury, and Fury is, like, sword, I guess? Yeah. And probably to, also to get the feel for Age of the Shield, which, not a bad mo show, Age of the Shield. I liked it. I really liked it here. I kind of dropped off eventually, but I did enjoy it. However, I did drop off when they decided to veer away from the main uh, MCU, like they were like for the first few seasons, they were trying to stick with it, like tie in even the whole from the up to like uh, Winter Soldier, Project Inside with the whole Hydra reveal, and eventually though they just stopped here. I guess when I think when they started making the Inhumans come in because the Inhumans movie failed. Or show was a show, yeah. But either way, uh, so yeah, I could probably take two, I guess. Fury. Okay, Fury still looks like. We've been gone a while. Okay, we got terrorists. Oh, you think I came back? Yeah, after five years, like being You're in no snapped and that lies before us. and blipped oh, back. Friend. Whoa! All these people, wild freaking scrolls. Nicholas J. Fury. There's Avengers. Yeah, where are the Avengers? Where are the Avengers? You're the most wanted man on the planet. Okay, we had we had War Machine there? With the Maria Hill? That's a sample? Crawl, okay. Oh, it's like a scroll. Like a scroll. Oh, we got super scrolls. One last fight. Okay, so they're going f for like one last hurrah with Nick Fury. Because, yeah, keep in mind, he, he decided to take a, after being a blip back, apparently he decided to take a little break here, because if, I know that was a scrawl here, but he's been, five years have passed by, the world has 
kind of changed a lot, obviously, dealing with the loss and just trying to move on and sorting things out here. So when he came back and everyone else here, he was at a loss here. Too much has happened. So if he decided to take a break, sort things out. And he's still, yeah, it looks like, looks the same as the last time I saw him in, well, obviously a bit more older. He definitely grew out that little beard, beard thing here. From last time we saw him, like, most up to date, I guess, was in Age of the Shield, where he pretty much said, kind of said indirectly that Coulson's an adventure. And he gave him, like, that black box thing, the whole bowl of uh, Shield secrets. But yeah, we've got scrolls here. I like how they finally ask, where are the Avengers here? And we see Don Cheadle here war as Rhodey, War Machine. We also see Maria Hill, who... Yeah, Maria Hill is uh, working for Stark. So yeah, we do. We are going to get some Avengers here. Well, he, she was, but I guess she's, who's she working for now? Actually, because... Yeah, there's, there's Maria Hill. I didn't think, I mean, she got older, but yeah. Don Shield still looks, so, Rhodey still look, looks like Rhodey, still looks great. Yeah, let's say that. Black people, you age phenomenally. I mean, I, okay, rest, Lance, like, let's take a look at Lance Hendrickson. Rest in peace, man. But when they, when they reveal that he was, he died at the age of 60, I'm like, looking at a picture of him, it's like, he was 60 years old? Man, I would have, the way he looked, I would have thought he was in his 40s. He looks that damn good. But, so, yeah, wow. But they, yeah, I mean, Ernie Hudson still looked, he didn't look that old compared to the rest of the Ghostbusters when they appear in Afterlife. Oh, boy. And even right now here, like, Samuel L. Jackson still looks pretty damn good here. Like, even with that gray and everything like that, <laughs> I mean, I'm a bit of makeup, obviously, especially for the, the eye. But yeah, and so we'll, we'll learn here that he is the most wanted man in the world. Doesn't the, the world think him dead? Well, okay, not everyone thinks him dead here. Like, obviously, publicly he's dead here, but... Yeah, of course, we got the scrolls, everything like that. So we have, a th we have like, a... This guy's a scroll as well, but we also got, like, Shadow... A uh, shadow war probably been happening since like the nineties, after Captain Marvel and everything, etc., etc. Is oh oh wow! I just I just know this guy here. It's the uh, yeah the agent the agent the from uh Black Pan Black Panther. Nice. So we're yeah we're obviously that makes sense here. So we're we're getting a lot of the aside characters, of course, coming back in with some ma notable major characters. Like I said, we got Rhodey there, Maria Hill. The only time I've ever seen Maria Hill uh is late lately are these uh TV series. But yeah, like this the show asked where are the Avengers, and it looks like they they hint that we could get the answer to that here. Like where are uh the Avengers here right now? Here, I mean, this will be a perfect place here to have Natasha, Black Widow, the ultimate spy. Yes. Uh, I am so sorry. Oh, God. It just popped into my head. Uh, that, that name just popped into my head when, you know, secret invasion, cult clandestine crap. I, it popped into my head. Head that they put they popped in my head here, and when I said it, that's when the rest the rest processed in my brain here. Like, yeah, she's dead as well. She's dead, you know, after the whole Soul Stone thing. So I, yeah, that, oh boy, ay ay ay. I'm okay. All right, so never mind that. Um, but we also what what, what about Bucky? Again, I have not watched Fal Falcon and the Winter Soldier, so I have no idea what happened with that, with that one, but he's a soldier. Did a, lot, did a lot of shit here, so this could be something he, he'd be up for. 
I would also say Hawkeye, but well, the Hawkeye series, I don't know what happened in Hawkeye. Again, I, uh, I, I can't really say. All, all the... Um, all the people that would look like they'd fit in this kind of uh, storyline here with shadow stuff, I don't know what their current state are because I don't know what the how their story went with the show. Maybe one day I'll just binge it. And yeah, again, like the Ages of S.H.I.E.L.D. crew here, I guess they did technically jump reality or something. So, what, there's no uh, Agent Phil Coulson here in this, in this uh, continuity now anymore or any of that? I mean, I don't know. <sighs> I mean, is there, like, did, or have the Age of the Ages of S.H.I.E.L.D. team been completely, like, jumped out of the universe? It can happen. I've seen it happen multiple times. Oh well. So yeah, thank you for watching. As always, comment what you all thought. Like and subscribe for more videos. Till next one. This is Mixon. Logging out.